The Curlewis Golf Club has secured its water future. This is the Halcoa Point Henry Complex, just out of Geelong. I'm here at Fine Art College where the girls are getting right into the Closing the Gap program. Welcome back to News Geelong on this Friday evening. White Balloon Day is Braveheart's signature event. It's held annually during Child Protection Week. And that continues to support awareness and fundraising for Australian children affected by sexual assault. With a principal fundraising initiative which enabled Brave Hearts Incorporated to continue the delivery of its vital services to protect our children. White Balloon Day has seen white themed events, wear white days at schools and donations with the White Balloon Day website to help educate, empower and protect Australian children. So be involved and go to the White Balloon Day website and make your donation. Bowen Health has announced its new branding that reinforces its position as a leading provider of healthcare and training. Now known as University Hospital Geelong, Ian Nichols reports. Bowen Health is seriously planning for the future. A rebranding program is well and truly in place. We see the logo behind us and also the rebranding of Geelong Hospital, now known as University Hospital Geelong. And we're getting the story from the Chief Executive Officer, Professor David Ashbridge. About a week or two ago, we, um, we relaunched uh, the branding of, of, um, of Barwon Health and a commitment to the future. And, uh, and, and in the process of doing that, we also re renamed the Geelong Hospital Hospital to the University Hospital Geelong. This is this is a, obviously a significant step, and we've been the uh, uni we've been the Geelong Hospital for about 50 years. But there's been three three name changes for the uh, for the Geelong Hospital since 1851. So it's something that happens about every 50 years or so. But it's not happened because of time. It's happened because it's a reflection of where we are and where we're going. The, the, um, specifically, we're an organisation now that has grown from being a very significant country and regional provider to being a significant contributor to the Victorian health system. We, are, no, we're, we're, uh, we now have uh, over 6,000 staff. We have a very significant uh, capital program. You can see the cranes around us. You know, we've got putting, we're putting on about an extra 100, 150 beds. We've got a world-class research facility opening a, well, opening. A, uh, across the road and only last year we were acknowledged as a, um, the best teaching and training institution in Victoria. So, so the, the combination of commitment to research, quality of training and comprehensive service delivery, the board felt was uh, uh, we needed to communicate that to the, uh, to the uh, broader community and also it serves to attract the best workforce to actually come in and, and work in Barwon Health and specifically in the University Hospital Geelong. So it's, a, it's, it's not only where we are, it's where we're going. Yes, well the future is very important. This is not only a tremendous growth area, but it was probably time to refresh and University Hospital Geelong has a very powerful message behind it, hasn't it? Yeah, it's, it's got a message to internally to, to the staff as well as externally I mean internally it motivates it motivates the staff to be good at teaching to be good at research and to be and to uh, be contemporary in our in our in our practice and we are that and we'll continue to do that to the community it, it sort of says that we are a, an institution of standing that we're growing and that we are uh, we're an, inst an institution to be proud of in the, in the community and I'm I'm personally very proud to lead an organization that is that is uh, delivering so well to the to the community and and we think this branding will continue to grow the to grow the services to the community to grow our research and, and to improve our our uh, training capacity so in my view this is a as I said it's not only it's not only where we are where we're going but it augurs very well for the future of health and education in Geelong and we're we're really committed to obviously committed to the community of Geelong we're committed to our relationship with our university partner uh, Deakin University and uh, it's, the, it's one of the pillars that I think that the future of Geelong is going to be based on is the calibre of our health education framework. Well, I think it's important also to note that this is more than just a cosmetic change. I mean, we love the new logo. It gets the mind yeah. thinking. <laughs> and people are talking about it. But uh, it's, it is more than just that, oh, isn't it? Oh, yes. It's, it's absolutely more than that. It's so much more than, than advertising. I mean, this is, I mean, this is a reflection of 
I mean, the, the, the logo itself brings together, it's a solid logo, it's, it's heart shaped, it's about our caring for the community, it's about our commitment to excellence. And so when we did, when we did the sort of research around that, these were the sort of qualities that, that the, the, the community saw in Barwon Health and they also, so we've built on that and we've probably moved from a, from a, a logo that was uh, more related to the lifestyle of, of, of the region to a, to a logo which reflects the high calibre institution. It's a solid logo, it's a cutting edge heart. Well, we know when then people and organisations change their names and their addresses and things. It, it, there's a lot of work involved. Uh, would you say that uh, changing over has been quite a, a big project for you? Look, it's a, it, it, it's a significant project. It's significant because, I, as I mentioned earlier, it happens you know, not from all, not frequently and so you want to get it right we want we so we went through an extensive governance approvals process we went through extensive focus groups we talked to our clinicians and so what we delivering what we delivered in the in the uh, re, in the in the rebranding was all those ideas coming 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 together my view is that in 20 30 years time people will look back as to, at, at 2014 as being a seminal year in defining the future of Barwon health well it's very impressive and we must congratulate all in involved in the rebranding. It's here to stay and it will see us through a very long period of time, I'm sure. And we'll make, and, and we'll be, we're, we continue to be proud to deliver the services to the community that we serve. At Barwon Health, this is Ian Nichols for News Geelong. Thank you, Nico. We go to a break and return with the world of Geelong sport after this.